All right, going to do a video exposing this fake Christian movie company called PureFlex.com. They make quote unquote Christian movies, but I'm going to show you that they're promoting false religion and promoting uh, wicked stuff. So go on their website, PureFlex.com, and go on the uh, sorry about that uh, Skype. Go on their featured page, and already you're going to see. Uh, I mean, if you're if you have the Holy Spirit inside of you, you're going to see some problems already. So, you know, first of all, you got immodest women, you know, leggings and wearing skin tight pants. Kind of a problem there. Uh, Christian Mingle, you know, the dating website, the lost sodomites on there. Uh, <clears throat> scroll down. Uh, you know, that's kind of provocative right there, you know. Uh, that's real nice. Uh, you, go, you, you just scroll down and. You, know, you have right there kind of getting sexual right sexual right there scared you know she's wearing short shorts you know uh, t uh i mean is that modest modest apparel i don't think so then you have you know these uh graven images of jesus christ you gotta watch out for some of these so-called bible movies about jesus christ because they have a graven image of jesus christ Acts 17 29 says we're not supposed to make any images of the godhead you know right here you have a film and you have a nun pictured there and for any Christian who has the Holy Spirit, you'd know that Roman Catholicism is a pagan false religion and that is just nothing but a perversion and a corruption of Christianity. But they're promoting Roman Catholicism as if it's just another, just another branch of Christianity when it's actually a pagan false religion. Then you go to their faith section and lots of problems here too. For example, they got, I, where, the, where is that? You know, they got this thing, uh, where is it? I had, I had it earlier, I don't know where it went. Oh yeah, here it is, see, look, the best of Fulton J. Sheen, J. Sheen, a Roman Catholic, who's dead and in hell right now, you know, and holding up that pagan Eucharist, you know, promoting as anvil, anvil, evangelistic, you know. Uh, this is not Christian. Roman, again, Roman Catholicism has nothing to do, you know, there, uh, Billy Graham's Crisis of Faith, promoting Billy Graham. You know, Billy Balaam, as I call him Billy Balaam. Yeah, he, he was a wicked false prophet. Uh, here again, Bishop Fulton Sheen, promoting the pagan hocus pocus religion, uh, Roman Catholicism. Uh, I mean, the fact that they promote Roman Catholicism is already big problems. Uh, you could just scroll down more. I mean, they already got crossing Rome. You know, again promoting Roman Catholicism. The uh, about church history. Yeah, it's about Catholic church history. You know, Roman Catholicism again is a, a pagan hocus pocus cult, and you know, Apostles' Creed, which is totally Roman Catholic. You can just scroll down some more. You know, uh, yeah, Mother Teresa. You know the. Uh, Catholic saint have here a graven image of Jesus Christ. I mean, I could just go on and on. And you can go over here, you know, just all this, all this stuff they got here. Uh, I saw some stuff here earlier. I forgot where it was. I forgot where it was though. Uh, see, look here, Catholic heroes. They got one about Catholic heroes. So again, promoting the uh, pagan hocus pocus cult of Roman Catholicism. You know, again, Roman Catholicism has nothing to do with Christianity. Roman Catholicism is a uh, pagan cult. Uh, you know, I go by, by, you know, all that down there. Biographical, you know, everything like that. Um, I saw some stuff here earlier, I forgot where it was. Uh, where was it? I saw, I, I forgot where I, I forgot, I, I accidentally exited. Here it is, uh, Pope Benedict, you know. Uh, promoting Pope, the Pope, you know, probably the biggest cult leader in history, Pope, the Pope, you know, uh, Billy Graham, a prophet with honor, yeah, he was a false prophet, that's what he was, here you got the Catholic Eucharist, I mean not Eucharist, the uh, Rosary, uh, Augustine, promoting that Catholic saint, you know, it, it's just crazy, I mean, the fact that they, again, I'll say it again, the fact that they promote Roman Catholicism is enough to realize that, that you know, this is, a, this is wicked. 
because Roman Catholicism has butchered and killed true biblical Christians. Um, you can scroll down. And the thing is, even before I even knew the whole thing of Roman Catholicism and Babylon and everything, I always knew that Roman Catholicism did not line up with the Bible. I mean, any true Bible-believing Christian uh, knows. And you know, they got answers in Genesis, which a whole lot of problems there, too. Uh, again, Fulton Sheen, Good Friday special. You know, again, promoting the uh, pagan religion of Roman Catholicism. Rosaries, you know, all that. I mean, if you haven't already seen enough proof, and again, more graven images of Jesus. Visits to the scapular. I mean, totally Roman Catholic. Oops, what the? What did I just hit? Uh oh, that was that was not good. But you, you know, you, you get the picture. I mean, they're just promoting false religion. They're promoting. Uh, cults like Roman Catholicism, they're promoting, you know, sinful stuff, you know, a, a graven image of Jesus Christ, all that stuff. Again, more Roman Catholic stuff. Um, where was it? I mean, just so many problems. So, this is a warning about Pure Flix. Uh, they are not Christian, and to be honest, what they're doing is they're trying to basically Christianize Hollywood stuff. And you can't Christianize something that, that uh, God is against. So, yeah, this is a warning about Pure Flix. I would stay away from it. Um, they're promoting false religion. They're promoting all kinds of weird heresies. You know, it, it's ridiculous. And the fact that they're promoting Roman Catholicism is enough to know that, yeah, this is not good. So, anyway, God bless you. Goodbye.